Binge Dog Sound Shield Safety Glasses, Eye Protection and Ear Protection in One Convenient Combination. No more misplacing earplugs, and you'll have hearing protection with a noise reduction rating of 25 decibels whenever and wherever you need it. The earplugs are connected to the frames by cords. Just slide the toggle to retract them, and they store in compartments in the earpieces. The glasses themselves are top-notch. They carry a high-impact safety rating and are hard-coated to resist scratches. They also have an anti-fog coating and provide protection against both UVA and UVB rays. Available as regular safety glasses or as fit-over prescription glasses, they incorporate rubber temple interiors for superior comfort and fit. To top it all off, a microfiber pouch is included to store and protect your sound shields when you're not wearing them. Shop safety is important, and there's no more convenient way to protect your eyes and ears than BenchDog Sound Shield Safety. Need an extra set of hands in the shop? Armor's Butcher Block Dog Table is a workstation that will leave your old work surface collecting dust. With its innovative auto-adjust one-hand clamping technology, customizable table settings, and high-quality construction, you can tackle any project that comes your way. The work surface is a solid maple butcher block equipped with a grid of peg holes designed to fit the armor dog clamps. These vertical and horizontal clamps allow you to create an unlimited number of clamping angles and combinations. Customize your ideal workbench to fit whatever project you're working on. The solid platform won't bore, bend, or wear out like many plastic and MDF bench tops, and will offer consistent pressure from the clamping system. Armor believes one thing. Your tools are there to help in building your project, not become the project. So all clamps are designed with the patented auto-adjust technology for easy one-handed clamping. This revolutionary design allows the jaws to automatically adjust to and grip different size objects quickly without manually fine-tuning the adjustment. Set the desired clamping pressure and the jaws consistently apply that pressure to the different sizes of the material. No continuous adjustment needed. Set your pressure, push down to engage, and now you have your hands free to focus on your project. Vertical pressure is applied by Armour's horizontal dog. The auto-adjust technology, in conjunction with the seven and a half inch post, allows the user to select the desired pressure and clamp materials of heights up to five and a half inches above the table surface. And you can use the rubber fitting to reduce marking on any delicate pieces. With the inline dog clamp and accompanying fences, you can apply horizontal pressure up to 550 pounds. Outfitted with the same auto adjust technology, the inline clamp features a push bar that's adjustable up to three and a half inches before engaging the one-handed clamp. The pressure will always stay the same, even after disengaging and adjusting the bar. The clamp also features a non-marring foot that provides firm holding pressure and won't leave marks on your projects. The foot also features a notch that will allow clamping of corners. Armor fences can be used as guides or together to form corners. They feature adjustable dogs that slide on the underside of the fence to allow the option of mounting a straight edge or angle. The fences are reversible with a high side and a low side to accommodate variations in work thickness and length for sanding and routing. Tables are available in two sizes and are fully customizable with additional anchor points on each table frame. Build it how you want it to fit your project.
Even though they may look square, many wall corners do not form perfect 90 degree angles. So each corner needs to be measured individually, and that measurement must be accurate to get a tight fitting miter. Now the old way of doing this was to take a bevel gauge, adjust it to fit the corner, lay the bevel gauge on top of a protractor, read the angle on the protractor, and then divide that reading by two. That provided the miter saw setting. Well, fortunately, there's a much faster, simpler, and more accurate way. This 505P protractor from Stara Tools is designed just for this job. Place it in the corner and open the wings until they come into contact with the wall. Now, and this is the slick part, simply read the miter saw setting directly from the tool. No calculating, no transferring measurements, and practically no chance for error. Now there are two types of crown miter joints, inside corners and outside corners. Here are the steps for making each. In most cases, the crown molding bottom is the edge that has the most detail. One thing is common to both inside and outside corners, and that is the molding must be placed into the saw with the bottom edge up. In other words, the bottom edge will always be against the miter saw fence. It's also important to keep in mind whether you're cutting the left hand or right hand piece of molding. Okay, here we go. When cutting the left hand piece of an inside corner, swing the miter arm to the right and place the work piece on the right side of the blade. To cut the right hand section of an inside corner, swing the miter arm to the left and place the work piece to the left of the blade. I know this can seem complicated, but don't worry about taking notes. You can download a simple table directly from Sterrett Tools by going to featured.sterrett.com slash crown. Here's how to handle an outside corner. Measure the corner angle using the Sterrett 505P protractor. Read the saw setting and set the miter saw arm. When cutting the left hand piece of an outside corner, the miter saw arm should be swung to the left and place the workpiece on the right side of the blade. And finally, when cutting the right hand section of an outside corner, swing the miter arm to the right and place the workpiece to the left of the blade. Whenever possible, nail the crown molding into wall studs and ceiling joists. A pneumatic nail gun will save a lot of time and avoid the possibility of damage resulting from missed hammer blows. No question about it, crown molding properly installed is a beautiful thing. Introducing Woodpecker's Steel Straight Edge in 12, 24, and 36 inch lengths. This is the straightest woodworking straight edge on the market with a tolerance of two ten thousandths of an inch per 12 inches of length. With that extreme tolerance, you'll set up machinery with unmatched precision. Like setting your joiner tables to ensure they are coplanar and making sure your joiner fence is straight, as well as your router table fence. This straight edge is perfect for setting the bottom rollers of your planer, either below the table or above. Test your table saw top for flatness, including extension wings. Plus, use the 12 inch straight edge to test the flatness of your hand plane sole. Each steel straight edge is 7 seconds of an inch thick, so they're stout and easily stand on their edge while you do your checking. For unmatched precision in your setups and projects, order the Woodpecker's Steel Straight Edge today.